guys, Shane Stars with DroidMotorX.com. Today I'm going to show you guys how to unlock the bootloader on the HTC One. Now this is the one that I bought directly from HTC.com, but this should work on any variant of the HTC One. So we'll go ahead and get started. You want to head to HTCDev.com. From the homepage of HTCDev.com, you'll want to click Unlock Bootloader. Get started. Okay, then you're going to select your device. It is the HTC One. I don't see the One listed, so we'll go to All Other Supported Models and begin Unlock Bootloader. And then you'll just need to log in to your account. Okay, you'll see this screen. It's asking you, do you wish to continue? If you unlock your device, it may void all parts of your warranty. So we'll go ahead and select Yes. Okay, and we'll go ahead and acknowledge the legal terms and proceed to the unlock instructions. Okay, next you'll want to go ahead and boot into bootloader mode. So we'll go ahead and power off the device. Okay, once we're powered down, we'll hold the volume down button and power. Once we're in the bootloader, we'll go ahead and select the fast boot. So just highlight it with blue and hit the power button to select. Then we'll connect our device to the computer with a USB cable. Next, we'll proceed to step five. Okay, it says on your computer, create a new folder where we will be putting ADB and Fastboot. So you'll need to install the SDK. Uh, you see the requirements are over here. The Android SDK is here. That's what this is doing. If you have the Android SDK already installed, you can just move forward here, uh, which I do already have it installed uh, but this page will tell you how to set that up it's pretty simple okay so you'll need to go ahead and open up a command prompt okay you can type fast boot devices and that should show up there so that's your device now we can go ahead and move forward since it does see our phone we're just going to type fast boot oem get identifier token so we'll just copy that and paste that, click enter, and there's your identifier token. And then we're just gonna highlight the box there minus the info. So we'll right click, hit mark, and then we'll just go all the way from this arrow all the way down to this arrow. So just paste the string of text into the token field and hit submit in order to receive your unlock code binary file which you'll receive in your email. So we'll go ahead and paste that there. You want to paste everything, including uh, all your arrows there, just like you copied it, and we'll go ahead and submit that. Okay, so this token was submitted successfully, so now we'll need to go and uh, check our email. Okay, so you'll find the email from HTC. It should appear in your inbox instantly. This is attached to this email is your unlock bootloader key file. To use this file to unlock your device, simply follow the remaining instructions. Be sure to save this email. Uh, that way you don't have to go through all that process again. This is the code bin here. Okay, so save the file in the Fastboot folder. So we'll go ahead and go back to our email and we'll download that. Okay, so now we need to find the folder uh, where that unlock bin was downloaded. So we'll just open. So in the folder where that resides, you may want to put that in your Fastboot folder, in your Android SDK. If, if it doesn't work for you in the download folder, you can move this to your Android SDK folder where your Fastboot file is, and it should work a whole lot easier. Uh, but what we'll do is I'll go Shift, right click, open a command window here, and we'll just copy this code. I will copy this command and paste that and hit enter. So it's now unlocking the device. So if you pick up your phone, you'll see this screen here and you just wanna read the warning there, basically just telling you that if you do this, it may uh, void your warranty. So we'll just go ahead and say yes. Uh, we'll scroll up with the volume button, select it with power. Okay, it looks like unlocking the bootloader did wipe my data. So just keep in mind that when you do this process, it will wipe your data. Okay, so now our bootloader is unlocked. 
It says that if we want to re-lock our bootloader, all you have to do is type fastboot OEM lock in the ADB command prompt, and that will re-lock the bootloader of your phone. So anyways guys, that has been the method for unlocking the bootloader on your HTC One. That should work for all variants. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to give it a big thumbs up. Subscribe to this channel for more coverage on this device. Thanks guys for watching. You find more of me at droidmoderx.com where I'll have the latest in Android and tech news. Follow me on Twitter at droidmoderx. Be blessed and I'll see you in the next one.